our next video, man, y'all know we got a boy back up in here, all city, man. He's gonna be talking about the seasons. Um, you know, we spoke briefly on the season earlier. Seasons are back. Did 2K add anything to the season? I'm just, I'm just gonna go ahead and call it. If I hit level 40 early in 2K24, if I hit level 40 in two days, 24 hours, No way they bring the season back the same way that it was in here at 2K23, right? Like, There's no way 2K bring back seasons the exact same way, right? Like, can we all agree? Can we all agree? There's no way that we are about to witness seasons Come back the exact same way. Hey, come on, man. Please do not let us hit level 40 in 24 hours. I would not mind season coming back if it's a grind to it. Please do not let us hit level 40 in 24 hours. But see, here's the thing, y'all. They saying seasons are back. They haven't explained to us how, though. It could be a different type of season. I cannot, for the life of me, think that 2K would bring seasons back the exact same way. I'm thinking that it's going to be a new system within the season. This seasons is probably the one of the most hated things in 2K. Can y'all think of something that is more hated than seasons? I, I don't think I don't think I don't think that's something more hated than seasons. My nigga say real run. Yeah, okay. Defense. I'll go with defense. Defense in general, then seasons. Okay, I can rock with that. Let's see what um all city got to say, but before we do, y'all already know what to do, man. Go sub up if you enjoy the content. But one thing to do for sure is to do what what I just did. Click that like button, man. Please, dog. He said whites are, are more hated. I don't know if whites are more hated than seasons. The bell out badge. Gameplay then seasons. Okay, y'all got some good ones. Y'all got some good ones. I go with I go with gameplay. Defense seasons. Seasons still ass though. They just that make sure we stay on with seasons or ass. But oh yeah, multiple shot timing. That shit crazy. Man, it's a lot of shit to hate then. Let's let's go ahead and say that. There's a lot of shit that we can say we hate about 2K. The adrenaline bars, the awareness. Okay, we all got that understood then. It's a lot of shit we can say are bad. But seasons, can we all agree? Fuck seasons. The hairstyles. <laughs> like, we, hey, okay, we got it. We got it, y'all. There's a lot of shit that we can hate about 2K. The seasons are bad, y'all. Seasons are bad. Um, But like I said, y'all, 2K could have changed the system of how seasons operate. Uh, 2K could All right, yeah, there's going to be a 
quick one seasons are officially confirmed for nba 2k24 we have the official rollout we want to review that so you guys know all the dates that you should be receiving information for 2k24 if you're new here we have a huge goal this year to reach 100k subscribers you guys could help make that happen by dropping a sub right now i greatly appreciate it we're definitely going to do our best to keep you guys up to date with everything Thing that's going on with NBA 2K24. And I just want to very quickly add before we get into the NBA 2K24 official rollout schedule, if you're looking for players to run with on 2K, come on out and join our Discord. We'd love to have you. The link for Discord will be in the description below. Let's get into the schedule. This rollout was first sent to me by our good homie, Hi. All City Big Heck, but since then it has bad, officially been released on 2K's Twitter. I hear a lot of rumbling throughout the 2K community saying that we haven't gotten any news for 2K24. Normally, 2K likes to practice the same exact rollout each and every year. There may be a day or two difference from year to year. Well, for NBA 2K24, a lot of you guys are going to be heavily disappointed because they pushed that about two weeks back. Last year, we got gameplay news on August 3rd. This year, <laughs> G said he got to search the city for um a rap lyric just to play one of my career games. <laughs> We're getting ah. gameplay news on oh, August 14th. Tough. I have no idea why 2K pushed that back. Maybe you guys did so many pre-orders that they like they could push it back. They're not worried about that funding. On August 14th, we'll get gameplay with Pro Play. So they're going to explain and break down what Pro Play is going to be like on 2K24. On on the week starting August 21st, we're going to get information about the W game mode. We're also going to get information about my, my NBA and 2K is going to explain Mamba moments, okay. which should be very similar to the Jordan moments. Starting the week of August 28th, we're going to get information about my career. We're also going to learn a bit more about the city, the new city coming to new gen. And we're going to get info on the my team game mode. And this is how we found out that seasons are officially back for 2K24. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. You guys share your thoughts in the comments section below because I definitely love your feedback. I know a lot of people feel like they just need to give us better rewards. Rewards. And see, I can, I can, I can um, agree with that. I don't think season would be that bad if they had better rewards and it wasn't so short. Um, I, I, please, man. But you know, 2K already said it's too late to make requests, y'all. That's what the video said. Once they had it in the video, man, let's go back and find it. Once they had it in the video, dog, the man said it's too late to make requests about 2K. Um, hold on, let's find it again. Let's find it. Hold on, where is it? Man says it's too late to be asking for shit, man. Where is that? Uh, I can't find the shit, but the man said it's too late to be asking for shit, man. Bro, I, I'm not. Bro, that season shit be running people off the game. Let me ask y'all this. Let me ask y'all this. Okay, we got crossplay. Will crossplay help seasons? Okay. Most of our gripe with seasons is that it's too short, right? Damn, y'all saying crossplay won't make it a difference? And what I mean by that is, okay, we know season make people get off the game early. By it being crossplay, that crossplay not saving it. Mm, 2K uh, put down my team reward in part, season pass, and the team have. Yeah, that's true. In my head, I'm saying to myself, maybe, maybe 2K thinking like cross play is in the game, so they'll still have somebody to play, even if some people stop playing after they hit level 40. That's what I'm saying. But, you know, some people hit level 40, they're going to get off the game. And then some people may gonna still be playing the game and buy it being a crossplay. Everybody's saying crossplay would not save 2K. Damn, y'all must not really understand how. Listen, 
Let me, let me. Because I've seen Rio say that too. i seen Swante say that. A lot of y'all must not really be understanding where crossplay is. I don't think crossplay really hidden for some of y'all yet. I don't think some of y'all are being hit by the bug yet. I've been hit by the bug. I can see where crossplay is. I don't think some of y'all... And listen, this is just my opinion. I don't think the bug really hit y'all yet. No, I agree. Crossplay could be a crazy cover-up because of game, because of gameplay. I, I, I can agree with you. But damn, man. Y'all ain't, ain't showing no love for crossplay. I don't think y'all really know what that crossplay shit gonna do for real, for real. I can see it. I don't think some of y'all are seeing it yet. My G said we're gonna have to see. He said, now you got Xbox Sweaty, PlayStation Switch, all your uh, uh, long and parts. He said, I did on both console. Hold on. Now you got Xbox Sweaty and PlayStation Switch. All year long, all year long, the park are dead on both consoles. Which you you think the park's still gonna be dead with crossplay? Hmm. Damn. A lot of y'all feel like that though. Right now, yeah. So so hold on. So you saying? So if if crossplay was into two K twenty three, y'all saying two K twenty three would still be dead? Ah, uh, gameplay is bad. Oh no, my G said he think it would help. Yes, absolutely. Yep. Hmm, that's interesting. How would crossplay do into two K twenty three? Hmm. If I had to be honest. UK 23. Nah, I think it'll help. I think it'll help. I think it'll help. I think one of the biggest reasons 2K23 next gen wasn't wasn't good because along with gameplay and movement, but I think a lot of people just did got tired of playing against the same people. Didn't have anybody to play against. The the wreck, what they had not they I I I think crossplay would have helped. I think crossplay would have helped. I think uh, a lot of us got frustrated uh, waiting for games. The game was bad. The game with 2K23, in my opinion, gameplay is bad. Um, because they finna add a lot of microtransactions in the game. The quest about to say, beat the 100 PlayStation players. That's going to be crazy. Everybody plays the same on next gen. Yeah, I understand that. But I think when it comes down to it, we ain't have nobody to play against. We ain't have nobody to play on P5, Xbox X. We had to play against the same people every day. Am I going to community day? I don't know. They ain't sent me no invite. Would you play 2K if the seasons are the same and the game play the same plus crossplay? Yeah, man. Yeah, I'm playing it. Because. Because, bro, check this out. In 2K23, I did not like the game. But what made me really mad was I did not like the game and I had nobody to play. That shit was crazy to me. I was, I, I would have still been playing 2K23. The trash motherfucking shit that it is. But the fact that I got to play some trash shit in wait, nigga, I can't take that. I'm not finna sit here and play some trash shit and I can't get a game. If crossplay was into 2K23, speaking for myself, I think I would have still been playing. I would have been complaining about the shitty ass gameplay, but I would not have been sitting waiting for 20, 30, 40 minutes to get a game. That day, y'all remember. When I really left 2K23, it was just, I was overwhelmed of waiting. I got tired of waiting on a game. The game's shitty, and I'm waiting, I'm waiting. 
I'm playing a shitty game and I'm waiting. And I'm waiting. I'm playing a shit. That, that, that man, no, nah, that right there lead to a headache. That lead to a headache, dog. And the market was annoying. The market would have one v one every now and then, and then it would have the crazy three v three or five, and then it would just lame. I would just be honest. Most of the indoors events are lame. They don't have any excitement to them. How many, how many events actually excite you? Like for real, for real. What events excited us in 2K23? What game excited? What modes? Pro M? Pro M was cool for an indoor event. But everything else, indoor wise, just don't have it. It just don't have it. In my opinion, last year indoor event market was much better than theater. The market, I don't know why, but the market had a better appeal to it than the theater do. The theater don't excite me. I don't know. I don't know, man. Something about that theater just don't sit right. Rest 2v2. So you enjoyed that one? Okay. Um basketball guys, bro. That was an inner basketball guys was an entertaining competitive event. People take it. Uh it just, I'm just saying though, a lot of these events, they just don't grab us our attention like that no more. Just ain't exciting, though. But yeah, man, this season shit back. Season gotta be different. It got to be a grind to the season, man. Um, it, yo, can y'all hear me? Mic check, mic check. That kind of help with our gameplay than just these cosmetic items that prove to be irrelevant throughout the uh, annual cycle. But on the week of September 4th, the release week for 2K24, we're going to get information about season one and more. And that makes up the official rollout dates for NBA 2K24. In case you guys were interested, you don't need to be scrambling online looking for information on 2K24. So you saying the season need to be a ranked season? Um, so for the people that are watching on Twitch, y'all already know it's that time where they mute the audio. All right, let me let them know. Um, I had to let them know that they glitched the audio on Twitch. Yeah, they, they, I don't know how they always do this, but for some reason, YouTube is still working. So YouTube is still working, but the audio is glitched. And if somebody could go let them know, I just let them know. But sometimes they be, I don't know, they be like, I don't know. I be telling them and they still be over there saying it. <laughs> 24 you have the dates right here we're going to be going live to talk some more about this so if you guys want to stay connected come join our live stream we'd love to have you I want all right so so um I, I just don't i just don't i don't like the season coming back i don't like it it's not it's not good it's not it, especially if it's come back the exact same way i appreciate that big dog if it if it come back the exact same way, it's bad. All right, okay, I see y'all coming over from Twitch. Yeah, they be doing that sometimes, but it'll come back. It'll come back. Um, I don't know, man. Seasons, it could be a good thing, but at the end of the day, if it's come back the exact same way, we're not gonna like it. We want to grind for something. We want something to chase. It just is what it is. Like 2K should understand that by now. We want something to chase, dog. We want something to, to search for 
We want a hunger to, to conquer. We want to get that ledge reward, man. We want to reach the top of the mountain. We don't want to sit here, and, and I'm going to just be honest. We want exclus exclusivity. You know what I'm trying to say. We don't want everybody having the prize that we worked so hard to get. Man, listen, dog. Man, die damn. He get a mascot. He ain't been on the game. He ain't earned the mascot, man. He don't deserve the mascot. The people that put in the work, they put in the work. So now we're going to sit here and condemn the people that put in the work. The people that been grinding all the way to level 40. We're going to goddamn give the person that got to level 3 the same items. Come on, man. Come on, man. Like, we can't keep, like, at some point, the nigga that got level three need to earn and be happy with his level three item. We can't be giving the, the, the people that hit level 40 and the people that hit level three the same rewards. Hey, come on, bro. Get the fuck out of here. That's corny. That's corny, dog. My daughter got a hundred on her test and my other daughter got a zero. You think they both get the same rewards? Come on, man. Come on. We have to, like, we got to stop with that bullshit, dog. We got to stop with that. He said, I oh, got to be careful. Oh, no, no, we don't want to run away from the spot culture again. Well, I feel you on that. We definitely don't want them. We, we definitely don't want the running from the spot. But see, I don't. Okay, that's something that we need to address then, AJ. We need to address um we need to address throwing the win percentages. Now I know it's something small, but we need to address it. Who can need to go back to hiding the win percentages? Who can need to go back to hiding the win percentage? That's a small thing, but it definitely helped the community. It's a small little fix. That'll make a, a big difference in the 2K community. Because, you know, we do, get, we do get the runners. We do get them. But like I said, that's a small issue to what we have right now. The major issue is, is how do we get games? I think, I think crossplay fixed that. I, I just really do. Um, gameplay, that's on 2K. 2K got to fix that. Yo, shout out to everybody coming over. So for everybody that's coming over from uh, Twitch, and kick they be muting the audio it'll come back in a moment y'all just had to give it time he said um hide the court street too well I I, I I mean we can't keep hiding shit trying to help these bomb ass niggas out he said uh keep talking to shit bro you keep speaking straight facts said, man I appreciate that appreciate that we can't keep trying to take out everything to make these little bombs feel good too though We, you know what I'm saying? That's another thing. We can't get caught up in that. Let's please these niggas that they, they, they envy people that wins. So let's hide the win record. Let's hide this. Let's hide that. Man, some stuff, I'll say, I'm with you though. Let's try to let's try to help these niggas feel better about themselves. But God damn. Like, come on, we just can't keep taking out everything because y'all niggas losing all day and now you mad at the people that winning. Come on, bro. But um, y'all make sure y'all go drop a like on the video, man. We hope the seasons are different. We'll find out. Shout out to all city, man. Once again. That low on the bell on the